Sonnet and Harp was a collaboration with Stephanie Clausen. She helped us design the harp. Uh, she came up with some ideas for the harp to make it more comfortable for the player. She suggested a unique angle on the bass that is steeper so that it sits on your lap more comfortably. Other harpists had mentioned how a lot of lap harps feel too straight and it would be nice if a lap harp was angled a little bit so that it feels like you're playing a floor harp. The thing that I love about the sonnet harp is how comfortable it is sitting on my lap. A lot of small harps kind of wobble and you have to hold on to them, but I feel like this is a very stable setup. Sonnet harp sits on your lap, it won't fall away from you. So when you're playing, you don't have to focus on holding the sonnet harp. Sometimes when playing a lap harp too, you're covering the sound holes. So we put the sound holes on the side, which is a unique feature. So when the player is playing it, the sound projects out to who they're playing to and doesn't get muffled by their body. the range, it goes down to a C below middle C, but it also has another several octaves on top, so I can actually jump up an octave if I want to. 